Good afternoon guys. I wanted to do a quick test to see how the webcam quality, the microphone quality and all that is on the Google CR48. So since I was going to be making a little vlog anyway talking about this, talking about some stuff that's going on, I thought why not try it right now. Uh, this may not end up being uploaded but I thought I would go ahead and just try it. I'm doing this through the Chrome Notebook like I said, through YouTube's direct record from webcam feature. Basically as you saw, I did the unboxing yesterday. I used the netbook for the la notebook, whatever you want to call it, for a few hours last night, just doing everyday activity type things. I'm very impressed with it so far, I have to say. The day-to-day -day stuff, as long as you keep it not terribly, terribly in-depth, you know, as long as you don't have 15, 20 tabs open, it's not that bad. I noticed when I went over like four or five tabs, maybe a little more than that, uh, things would slow down a bit, but that could have also been because the battery was getting a little low. I, I drained it all the way down until it was completely dead, would not power on at all, charged it back up, and right now it says it's got 71% battery life. That's after using it a little bit at work today and just letting it sit. Um, let's see, I, I think I, yeah, I tested the VGA port, hooked it to a monitor at work. I tested, oh, snow must be falling off the house. Funny angle here. Um, no, I tested out the VGA port. I left it in standby mode a lot of the day. I showed it to a couple of coworkers, things like that. And like I said, it's it's great for a daily driver if a lot of what you do is online. For example, I spend a lot of time on YouTube, a lot of time on Gmail, Google Reader, Facebook, uh, Twitter, all sorts of things like that. And so far, very impressed. I also last night tried out the developer mode, or at least started to. Uh, did not realize, and no one really mentioned this, when you change it over to developer mode and boot it up, it wipes your profile. Not quite as big a deal because it does save all of your information, so the next time you log in, it pulls everything back down, but you, had to, you have to start all over and set everything back up. Again, it's like a three minute process, it's not a big deal. Uh, so what I'm probably going to do is put it in developer mode. I know uh, Joe Steiger mentioned, and a bunch of other people mentioned it, the uh, installing Ubuntu on it. And now I'm tempted. I really want to see if I can put Arch Linux on it, but I believe that would require compiling my own kernel. It may not even work. I don't know. Worst case scenario, I might try putting Ubuntu on it just to see how it performs. Because uh, the, the videos that are out there, there are two videos from one guy. They showed up on OMG Ubuntu and a couple other places. Engadget, I think, picked it up. It's great to see that already out there. It's crappy that it's done with kind of a, a low-quality camera, and it's really, really blurry. So I would like to do it. Uh, the same sort of thing and just do it at a much higher quality so that you guys can see yes it does work here are the specs that are being shown from Ubuntu things like that I, I don't know if that'll happen or not uh, I, I, I showed this to my wife and she's basically gonna try to lay claim to it uh, anyway I'm rambling on I just wanted to let you guys know how, so far how day one has been with the uh, the CR48 uh, it was a bit of a rough day at work if I get into the personal stuff for a minute I got an email from a former coworker that uh, a friend of mine, a, another former coworker, passed away yesterday. He had a heart attack at the age of 62. Uh, he retired just a couple of years ago. After coming back to work a few years before that, he had a, a stroke several years ago. Uh, recovered from it, went back to work, had some issues with our boss at the time and said, you know what, forget this, I'm retiring, I'm going on disability because he was eligible the whole time. Uh, so he went back home and worked on his motorcycles and his cars for years, two, three, four years now, I guess. Uh, and I got to see him semi-regularly during that time. So I was, uh, I was honored to have that chance to spend time with him outside of work, and he will definitely be missed. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and wrap things up. I've got to go pick my son up, but I just wanted to give this a try, and hopefully it doesn't look and sound terrible. But uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, Bob will be missed. Bob is the uh, the name of my friend who passed away, and I will be uploading more uh, uploading more <laughs> updates in the near future as I do more stuff with the CR48. Of course, I will. Uh, but thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.